Welcome back to more of the Game of Mind with Samuel Bam Let's Play of Legend of Keepers. That's it. I'm done. I got nothing else to say, unfortunately. <laughs> okay. What the hell am I going to do with this team? I don't even know. I suppose we can bring these folks back. And then, uh, we really need to see the therapist, I think, right now. Because a lot of people are suffering. Pretty significantly. I can't afford to do anything else other than I could extend, but I have I would have zero money. And I really need the money right now. Maybe I need the money. I don't know. There's an event, there's a plunder. I know I shouldn't at this point I probably shouldn't even bother with the merchant, but I just want to see if maybe I'll have something else. Apparently not. Okay. All we're getting are elementals and impalers. I'm not even going to bother with uh, giving him 20 gold to renew. It's just not worth it. What I will do is plunder and probably lose the monster for 10 weeks. It's worth a shot, I guess, right? Send a monster free. It's probably going to be another of the same monsters I keep seeing. All volunteers offer three weeks to get plus two motivation and three stacks of enrage. Uh... Let's do the 35% chance. I didn't see how many 100% chance one volunteer's out for three weeks. Plus two motivation. You don't really need the motivation that much. I'll take this one and try to get a monster. Well, we lost one, and we got another Earth Elemental in return. Oh, boy. Well, we lost our Earth Impaler. Then we get an Earth Elemental back. Okay. Do I even bother with a merchant now? I say no. It's not worth it. Okay. Um, let's give him plus one motivation because we have a lot of blood. Because I'm not scaring away any any uh, any humans here. Okay. Who needs to be taken out of here? Anybody? I hope not because I'm really tired of shifting people out. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Is it an ice impaler? It is. This is uh, just such a mess. <laughs> okay. Who are we dealing with here? Master bonus and a little bit of gold. Uh, monster and a tiny bit of gold. Or master bonus and a... Still not particularly large amount of gold, but that one has a... You know, these two have disasters with it. I'm going to go for this one. I'm not going to bother with the monsters, because we seem to only be getting elementals and impalers. And, well, they're fine. I like variety with my teams. You know, I'd like to be able to have some other monsters available to assist me in defending these areas. Okay. Who are we dealing with? So we have an herbalist in the front for some reason. She's going to heal. Nature damage to the back. Armor increased by 30. I guess that's why she's in the front. And then... Berserker. Okay. Morale loss reduced by 50. I don't have anything that does morale damage. And humans are gone. Air resist increased by 15. Sorry. All resistance is increased by 15. Okay, so this, thing, this guy's going to be real tough to kill. All right. So it's air and nature to the back row, physical to the front. So who has the best physical resist here? Probably... So Ice Elemental is 120. Earth Elemental is 140 HP, so I guess we're going to go with... Well, hold on. What's your... It has 80% nature resist, but negative 40 air. I don't think anything is going to resist both nature and air. I stand corrected. Um, air elemental. Get in the back. I might do double air elementals just to, you know, tank those hits. I think we're doing that. Not a great solution, mind you, but it's what we're going to do. <laughs> okay. And trap. I guess we'll just do furnace for now. It's not amazing, but it's, it's what we've got. Okay, so we have another air elemental. <laughs> now I'm starting to be glad I have so many air elementals. 
Let's see. There's nature and air. You're not great for that. Physical. Who's the best physical resist? Probably the ice elemental. Although it's not great. So. I think he has the most HP, though. Yeah. Not by much, but it does, it does have the most HP. So, let's go for that. I really should be using my upgraded monsters. Or my leveled up monsters. Seems kind of silly to not use them. Although all of these heroes have fire resists, so fire elemental is not great for this. Neither would be fire impaler. I guess we just go with ancestral elemental. Hope for the best. I guess. All right. I don't know why you're laughing. You're probably gonna get the crap kicked out of you by this team. Oh, I wonder how long these campaigns are. I mean, I know that I, I know that I um I selected a long game, but I don't know if that means that uh, if like oh wow, their hair is already negative. That's pretty good. Let's lower it even more. The herbalist, I meant her heiress is already really low, so let's lower it to like ridiculously low levels. Let's do that, right? 75, minus 75, and then we will Sirocco. Oh, that actually does extra damage to the other guy, too. Nice. That works out quite well. How did that do so much damage? Whoa, didn't I lower her damage output? Oh, it's vulnerabilities, damage taken. Whoops, my mistake. Okay, uh, oh, that's what I wanted to do. Damage dealt reduced by, that's fine. That's okay. Oh, actually, we can knock her out here, so that's great. With the uh, two Sirocco's. Okay. That's a relief. Now she can't heal anybody. That's great. That's not great. Okay. Do we quagmire this guy? I think he has good nature resist, right? No, he doesn't, actually. My mistake. What is your nature resist? Oh, right, you got enhanced resistances. Uh, sure. Let's just do Quagmire. It's not great, but it's the best I can do. You don't have air weakness on you anymore. That's kind of weird. I thought you would still have that. Okay. Oh, it's only for two turns. Okay. Did not realize. There was no way he was going to survive that hit. Okay. Well, might as well do a little bit of damage before this ice or air elemental gets defeated. Right. Oh. Wow. He's revived. Good for you. I'm surprised. I'm not going to survive another round, but survive uh, one round longer than I was expecting. Okay. Tropical Flood, not really necessary. Pollen Cloud, a lower nature resist. Would have been helpful in that first round. Not so much here. Let's just do Swarm of Mosquitoes. It's not going to do much, but the poison's nice. Oh, right. We get a furnace, too. Totally forgot about that. Okay. I think we just do magical brambles here. I know, it's a shock. I'm using the one attack that I use every single time. Okay. So their air weakness is... They don't have air weakness anymore. I'm tempted to use it. What's your air... What's your air weakness name? That's minus 20 air resist. I'm still going to go for Zephyr to lower their air resist even more. Okay. Let's see. So you have... So they have air weakness on them. So I can use Blizzard 
to freeze them. I think they might have burn on them too, but we're going to go with what we have here. Now that's an interesting synergy I didn't even think about until just now, is oh, it's only one stack of Frostbite, but I can use Frozen Thorns. Oh, uh, can I defeat him? I can't, but with Frozen Thorns I can, so let's do that. Cool. That actually worked out remarkably well, I gotta say. Let's do that. I think that worked on both of them, actually. All right, well, that's a cool synergy I never even realized. I'm going to start using those two together, I think. Okay. Max life plus 75, Magical Brambles. What do we got here? Ooh, level up for Magical Brambles. I think we're going to take that. Or Blight. Uh, no, we're, we're leveling up Magical Brambles. That's like, I mean, I use that all the time. There's no reason not to level that up. For me, I don't think there's any reason not to level it up. This, I swear... This Earth Elemental is useless. He loses motivation. He loses three motivation every single time he goes out there. That's not okay. All right. Well, we can swap him out for the other Earth Elemental that I have. So, might as well, right? You have four? Okay, so this Earth Elemental, or this Air Elemental, has four motivation. So, I'm not swapping him out get. Okay. Do we plunder or do we level up? Uh, I don't think I can justify leveling up. We don't have a lot of money. So what do we have here? Uh, morale review. Okay, so that'll get some uh, motivation back. That's good. And opportunity to send one of your monsters off. I uh, don't really want to do that. Let's see what we do for the plunder. Are we going to get all the same crap as usual? 75% chance tired for all monsters. Not really interested in that. Thank you. All volunteers out for two weeks. That's fine because, I mean, yeah, that's totally fine because we're not going to be in a dungeon for the next two weeks. Although they won't get the morale buff, I guess, from the therapist, but they get plus some motivation anyway, so that's probably what we're going to go for. They need to iron for it. No, we're, we're definitely going for this one. That's fine. Hunter gold guaranteed. Monster guaranteed. It's another fire elemental. Yay. All right. Do I really need to do therapy right now? The only monster that would benefit from the therapy right now would be the air elemental. Although that would really, that would honestly be very beneficial to go ahead. Because I do like having the, the trio of air elementals. It sounds ridiculous, but I don't mind it. What's coming up here? If I could find my mouse cursor, please and thank you. Check this. Okay, so business trip or event. Uh, let's do therapy. We'll just thank him. And then what? I don't have enough money for a training course, so never mind on that one. What do we have here? Uh, so you can punch or insult. I don't have any tears. So let's go ahead and insult them. Get some tears. I'll probably need them at some point, I'm sure. Business trip I don't want to do. I don't want to deal with even more monsters being out. Okay, whoa, what is this? Oh, right, it's this thing. So all employees get minus one motivation, but I get a hundred tears or a hundred. I'm sorry, hundred and five tears or hundred and five blood. You know what? I'll take it. That seems crude and crass, and probably a bit of an asshole move. But I need the tears, probably for some point in the future. I'm sure. <laughs> okay. What are we dealing with here? So we have get a monster and a little bit of gold. We get an artifact and a very small amount of gold. Or we can get a, a trap and 120, 175 to 225 gold. I kind of want the artifact. I'll be honest with you. Let's go for it. I'll take the artifact. It's not much gold, but I'm rarely leveling up monsters anyway, so 
I don't need gold as much as I usually do, although I really should be leveling them up anyway, because holy crap, this sorceress. 10% of heroes maximum life at the start of each fight. Great. And a ninja. Who is Ralos's whatever. Don't care. And so she's a scholar now. Speed increased by 20, so okay. Interesting. This uh Okay, so it's fire and air to the front, nature to the area. Fire and air. You're weak to fire, right? Yeah, you are. We might have to put fire elemental in the front. That's awkward. Yep, we have to put fire elemental in the front. <laughs> okay. He's going to get destroyed, unfortunately. <sighs> okay. Nature of the area. I forgot to move a bunch of other monsters around before I went in here, didn't I? Yes, I totally did. Okay. Okay. They have good nature resist, but bad other resists. I don't know what to do. I know it's a surprise. Compared with all the other times I've been doing this. Let's just keep doing what we've been doing, right? Double air elemental? Seems to be working out mildly okay. Not amazing, mind you, but... It's not horrendous. Let's see. Let's do... Polar portal? What are their air or nature? Okay, so they all resist ice. That kind of sucks. But oh well. We're already in it. Let's go for it. Furnace next. Okay. Air and fire to the front. Do have my other air elemental, or fire elemental available. With much more HP than the other one. There's air and fire. You also resist both, but not quite as well as the other. There's nature to the area. Uh... Okay. Fire Elemental again. Take up the front. Nature. I don't know what to do. Oh, you're level two also. Dexlet's target is... Oh. Well, I don't have anything with Frostbite, so... Well, unless I bring... Unless I bring the... Unless I bring both of them again... Which is a bit risky, because they both have really bad nature assist, and we have a ninja that we have to deal with. So, I don't know. On the other hand, who cares? It's a video game. It doesn't even matter what we do here. <laughs> if I lose, I lose. I'm not that concerned about it. No big deal. All right. Okay, so we're going to be... Uh, oof. That was a rough first round. Okay, let's... Oh, this thing has real... She has really high air resist, so this is not going to go well at all. Yep, this is going real bad. What's your fire resist, at least? Oh, I can't hit her. Oh, I can I can burn, I guess. Minus 25. 65% fire resist. Okay, let's go for Inferno, I guess. Not great. Okay, this is going remarkably badly. <laughs> Alright. Cool, 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 cool. I finally understand why that noise keeps happening. It's because the artifact is affecting the frost burn or the frost. Yeah, well, I guess that is what it is, really. Frostbite in the burn. What do we do here? Pollen clouds, nature resist reduced. Don't have any monsters that do nature. Oh, well, I have magical brambles. Uh, is it worth it for one attack, though? I feel like it isn't. 
do the swarm of mosquitoes, I guess. At least they're taking a fair amount of damage from, like, all of the... Uh, all the frostbite and the burn. So that's something. Okay. Brambles. Don't quite know why I yelled that, but... Oh well. So they're all going to go before I get a chance to go, and they're going to defeat our entire team. Right about now. Okay, not quite, but close. <laughs> unpleasantly close. Maybe not really unpleasantly close, but... Okay. I don't know what to do here. There's no way we're going to defeat... Oh, well, actually, if we do Inferno, then we defeat the ninja, so that's... That's great. I'll take that. Okay. So they're burned. And so Thunderstorm... I think is... Uh, yeah, I think Thunderstorm's a little bit better. Because we can at least lower resistances a little bit. It's not going to do much, but it's going to do something. Does she have any frostbite on her here? Not the weakness. No. Okay. In that case, we'll just hit her with that. I keep forgetting how low the Ice Elemental's like damage output is. There's no way this thing's going to survive. Oh, it did! Okay, then. Prove me wrong. Shut me up. Uh, what do you want to do here? I guess we'll just do this, even though I think neither of them have... Uh, I don't think either of them had negative air resist, right? I don't know. She did. Wow, she has minus 80 air resist. Wish I could take advantage of that. Oh well. So just stalactite. We're so close to getting them. Oh! We're so close. We might actually win. We did it. Wow. I'm a little surprised, actually, that we won that fight. Uh, troll beer. Prismatic stone or winged boots. So, monsters place the front game plus 30 speed. I need that desperately. What does prismatic stone do? A monster of their group can enhance resistances when an elemental is defeated. Well, we have almost exclusively elementals, so that's kind of interesting. Troll beer. Monsters place the front gain lose 50 speed. They get maximum life plus 50. I still would like the winged boots, honestly. Plus 30 speed. It's probably not going to matter too much in the grand scheme of things, but I still would really like some some speed boosts for some of these monsters here. Okay. Let's see here. So we can... I don't think it's worth it to go to the merchant anymore. We have enough monsters. I suppose. Uh, I don't think I have enough money to warrant going to the engineer to level up any traps right now. Um, equipment, rent out some traps. I could do that, possibly. Okay, let's do an event. See what we get here. I don't really want another unstable elemental. I have two of them, and I rarely use them. So let's just humiliate him and get a bunch of tears. <laughs> okay. Seminar. What is that one? That one buffs our party, I think. Uh, I think it does. Sanctuary debuffs the enemies, I think. I might need to start using these more often. I rarely use Sanctuary and Seminar. Um, yeah. Sanctuary, Seminar, or Siege. Story of my life. That'll be my autobiography title. As much as I'd like the money, I think Sanctuary might be the best option here. Because we can... Yeah, that might be the best thing we do here. Okay, so we can... Three stacks of poison. Oh, well, that's it. How long does this go for? Uh, next few months. Okay. 
Or we can get elemental weakness to start or vulnerability. I'm shaking increase by 30%. I like that. It's minus 10 blood and 15 tears. I will take this one. I think the vulnerability is probably the best here. Let's do it. Okay. Engineer, I'm not going to worry about. Let's just do another event. And what do we have here? I, I don't think I need any more tiers. I have 115 tiers right now. I don't think we need any more. Especially if they're trying to charge me money for it. Not particularly interested in paying money for tiers. Okay, so let's see here. You get a monster and a bit of gold. You get an artifact and a very small amount of gold. Or you get another monster and a decent amount of gold. I kind of am tempted with the, just more artifacts right now, quite frankly. So I'm going to take that one. Oh. Who do I need to take out? Oh, right. You need to take out air elemental. You need to take out fire elemental. Uh, let's put in other earth elemental. Probably shouldn't have two of them in the same group. Let's take out this fire elemental also. Let's move this second era earth elemental over here. And uh, fire elemental here, I guess. Who's, who are all of these that I haven't used in forever? Is this... Uh, Oh, it's the Earth Impaler. I was wondering what happened to that one. Uh, nah. Oh, wait. No, I have an extra spot open. Sure. Go ahead. On the team you go. Yeah, I think that's good enough for now. Let's go with it. Away! Onward, friends, to victory! Okay, who are we dealing with? I don't even remember. Did I go for the artifact? I hope I did. I don't even remember. <laughs> uh, all right, herbalist with increased armor. Again, great. We have another berserker. Uh, resistance is increased by 15, so this guy's going to be even more difficult to defeat. And another ice wizard. Oh, great. Uh, morale loss is by 50%. That's no big deal. Okay, I have to remind myself. This first team is going to get screwed up. Well, not this team, not here, but this first team is going to get all turned around and stuff. Okay. Let's do... Even though I think all of them are resistant to ice. No, eh, no, Berserker's not. Okay. I have to remember, they're going to mess with this team. So it's nature to the back, physical to the front, ice to the area. Nature of the front. Oh, sorry. Nature of the back. So if I have something that I would like to... I mean, really, Earth Elemental would be amazing for the back row. It'd also be good for the front row. So I'm going to put Earth Elemental in the middle. Let's see. Uh... Air Elemental is just pretty good overall, I would think. I should really should be leveling up the Earth Element or Air Elementals. Let's see here. Physical of the front. But you have bad nature resist, so I don't want to risk you getting shifted. Okay, if I put Air Elemental on the front. Oh, that's going to speed it up even more, which I don't really want, but that's okay. Fire Elemental has bad nature resist. Um, okay. Let me redo this. Because I forgot about the wing and boots. So... I could potentially put... Well, let's see. Hold on. What is your speed... So you have a speed of 20. None of this is going to matter much as far as the speed is concerned because the Ice Wizard is just going to slow everyone down again. So it's really not that big of a deal. So I don't even know why I'm bothering to spend so much time thinking about it. Let's just do the... I don't want to not put the Earth Elemental in the front, though, because I want to guarantee that it doesn't get shifted to, uh, to the front. Okay. Trip. Let's do Furnace. 
because I don't have any better options. I really should have leveled up my traps, I know. Okay. Now that they can't be shifted, physical to the front, nature to the back, ice to the area. Um, I still want to use you. I'll put you in the middle. Physical of the front. Who's got the best physical resist here? Not that. 25. You know, none of these monsters have particularly high physical resist. Why thorns to all monsters at the, st at the start of its turn? Okay. Uh, it's nature to the back, so I'm going to put Earth Elemental in the back just to soak up as much nature damage as you possibly can. And physical to the front. As much as I'd like to have another air elemental here. Let's see. You have 120 HP. You have 140. You're also resistant to ice. Let's bring ice elemental. He's going to get speed up too. So. We'll see. Okay. Oh. <sighs> I think after the initial sort of struggles that I had, I was honestly kind of hoping that the uh, Earth Elemental would get shifted to the back, but okay, that's fine. We'll just deal with what we've got here. Let's start with the Zephyr. Oh, I gotta, I gotta get better at sitting up. Oof. Okay, and everyone's slowed, so all of the enemies are gonna get two turns in a row. Really? Oh crap, we got. Sh why didn't I think about that? <laughs> I forgot that he was so weak to nature. I'm stupid. All right, great, awesome, fantastic. Just what I was hoping for. Okay, okay, that's all right. We'll deal. We'll just deal with it like we always deal with it. Damage dealt reduced, but yeah, let's probably do that. It would be nice to get rid of the Ice Wizard sooner rather than later, but we don't really have a way of dealing particularly good damage to him. So I would rather go ahead and fight off the Herbalist as best I can. This is not going according to plan. At all. <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate. I was really hoping that he might be able to survive another round. Oof. She's going to heal. Probably herself. Yep. Okay. Okay. That's all right. Now I really wish that I'd moved all of my monsters with nature attacks to the back so I could take more advantage of Pollen Cloud. Oh well. Uh, it's brambles, of course. Always brambles. Never anything else. I know. I'm boring and predictable that way. But damn it, they do a good job. Okay. All of them are slower than the Ice Wizard, huh? Jeez. This is not going very well. <laughs> uh, I should have put the, the frozen portal th at the second trap. That's my bad. Okay, so they're burned. So I can take advantage of Thunderstorm? Right? Yeah, Thunderstorm. I almost said Thunder Force, or Thunder Horse. Oh, we got two of them. That's not bad. Okay. Nature resist. It doesn't matter that much. We're gonna get him. Somehow. Don't know how he did it. Horn of Plenty. Monsters have 20% chance to deal a critical strike when attacked, or when attacking. Unholy, unholy Shroud. Uh, grants a chance to. Can't, oh, Frostbite. Uh, monsters attacks or steal morale. Well, I have none of those, so that's useless to me. 
Uh, protean barrel. Oh, right. Only was one trap, but it gains multi action. Uh, I think I'd rather have the Horn of Plenty right now. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. This is uh, interesting. It's a, I don't know exactly what I'm doing as far as like quests and are concerned. I don't know if I just have to like plow through the game as usual. I guess we'll see. But that's going to do it for today. Thank you everybody for watching this episode of Legend of Keepers. Please do click the like button if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to the channel for more of this. I will talk to you all next time.